Have you ever wondered why the star point of an induction motor is not grounded in industries? Today, we're diving deep into this critical electrical engineering concept. So, stick around to learn something insightful. In any electrical system, neutral grounding is typically done at the power source, such as the star points of generators or transformers. Why? Because this allows earth fault currents to have a return path from the fault point back to the source. This flow enables the proper operation of earth fault protection relays and makes fault detection and relay coordination much easier. Take a look at this example. When there's no neutral grounding, earth fault currents can't flow because there's no return path. However, with grounded neutrals at the source, the fault current finds a clear path to the source, allowing protection systems to function effectively. You might now be asking, why is neutral grounding necessary if it prevents fault currents in its absence? Well, neutral grounding offers several advantages. It limits phase voltage to phase to ground voltage. High voltages caused by arcing ground or transient line to ground faults are eliminated. Sensitive protective relays can be employed for earth fault protection. Over voltages caused by lightning are safely discharged to the ground, preventing dangerous reflections at an isolated neutral. Now, let's address the main topic. Why is the star point of an induction motor not grounded? Grounding a motor's star point creates an earth path for fault currents. Imagine a process plant with 10 motors, all with their star points grounded. This creates 10 additional paths for earth fault currents, complicating fault detection. With so many paths for fault currents, protection relays may fail to detect the correct fault location, causing nuisance trips and incorrect relay operations. Induction motors are balanced three-phase loads. However, system voltage imbalances caused by unbalanced loads elsewhere or conductor issues can lead to unbalanced currents in motor windings. To protect against such situations, design engineers often use negative phase sequence current protection. Even if there's a neutral voltage shift in the induction motor, grounding the neutral point is avoided to prevent nuisance trips in earth fault protection relays. So that's why we don't ground the star point of induction motors in industries. We hope this clears up your doubts. Make sure to like this video, share it with your friends and subscribe to our channel for more such content. If you have any questions or suggestions, let us know in the comments below. And hey, if you'd like to support us further, consider hitting the join button to explore exclusive perks. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.